Okay, I'm here at Geneva Rock at the point of the mountain with the emulsion tank. Not to be confused with the rest of the tank farm, this is a separate system just for emulsion. I went and talked to the plant operator, I'm good to unload, so I hooked up my hose, opened my dome lid. Now I need to get things started. Like usual, I wanna work my way from the tank back to my trailer. These are all automated valves, so we're just gonna use this system right here. We'll get this labeled a little bit better, but you can see unload here, so I switch it to unload. That will both open the valve and turn on the pump. You can't hear it, but the pump is now running. So following the pipe, the next thing in line is this valve. So I'm gonna open that valve. It's a little hard, so I'm gonna put the phone down, use both hands. I had to go get a torch and warm up the valve, which is okay, you might have to do that. So I got it open, so now I'm just following this back to my trailer. I don't have a sample valve, so I had to do the crack the dog ear approach. I can hear air. So I'm gonna tighten down these dog ears and then I'll open my valve and unload. Now while I'm unloading, I didn't mention this before, but you always wanna double check that this level shows the load can fit before you start unloading, which I did. I just forgot to mention it in the video. And now as we're unloading, we can actually slowly see that it's starting to go down. And of course, with any of these, all the way to the bottom might be too full. So check with the plant operator before you go all the way to the bottom. I was told I can go to about 13 feet and I should be just fine if I do that. So always watch the gauge while you're unloading. No sample needed while you're doing emulsion here. Just keep an eye on things. So I finished up, I unhooked. I just barely got done walking out the hose. It's a long hose. So be sure to lift it all up. I just flopped the one end over that and then slowly walked out lifting up the hose. Now I've set it down and I hooked up that bungee so the end of the hose won't fall down. So reverse order going from the trailer to the tank. Simply gonna close this valve, which is not very easy to close right now. Okay, got that closed. Clean hands, don't use gloves up here. Hit the off button. Gonna turn that off and hit the off button. That's going to shut everything down. Readout is at 75. Tank level down there just under 11. I'm going to fill that out on my driver trip sheet. Go hand it in and we're all done. Double check. That's closed. That's off. That's closed. Trailer's closed. Good to go.